Hi children, today we are going to continue subject science 1 standard 10 that is a second chapter periodic classification of uh, elements. In the last video we already seen what history of uh, elements, next Dover Reiner triads, next scientist Newlands octave rule and uh, afterwards what Mendeleev's periodic table. All scientists are discuss about the discovery of the elements with the help of uh, atomic masses. Now today we are going to learn modern periodic law. So modern periodic law given the scientist that is a uh, English scientist in 1913 AD Henry Mosley. He stated with the help of the one experiment done using the x-ray tube according the him what he stated he said atomic mass is uh, not uh, important for the element so what is the uh, important according to him the elements periodic functions of their atomic number now first you try to understood what is the uh, atomic number so nucleus is there in the nucleus there are the positive and that is known as a what proton so the number of a proton is equal to atomic number so the atomic number z of an element correspond to the positive charge of the nucleus or the number of proton in the nucleus of atoms of that elements so if any elements is there so nucleus is there in the nucleus there are the positive ions that is a known as a proton and that is a known as a what atomic number according to the henry mosley atomic number is a more fundamental property of an element than is the atomic mass that means what the scientist Henry mostly given the important of the atomic number. Atomic number means what? If we fit in the periodic table like the increasing order like the 1, 2, 3, 4. So the elements in the increasing order. Now he given the one law that is known as a modern periodic law. So what is the according to him? What is the law? the properties of elements are the periodic functions of their atomic number now before whatever the all the scientists they given the importance of what atomic mass but this scientist henry mosley is given to important of what atomic numbers Okay, now we are look the modern periodic table. Now see, first there are the seven horizontal rows that is a known as a what? Pirates. So seven horizontal rows that is a called as pirate. And there are the 18 vertical columns that is a called the groups. This may be asked for the definition for the one marks. Define the pirates. Otherwise what? Define the groups. Now, down see, there are the two separate series that is uh, known as the uh, what? Lanthanides and actinide series. Now, see the modern periodic table, first and second. First and second, that is uh, known as a uh, what? S block. And uh, from 13 to 18, that is uh, known as a uh, what? P block element and from 3 to 12 that is a known as a what D block element and the whatever the bottom the series that is a known as a what F block elements. Now here the how many total elements are there? Here is a modern periodic table mostly he kept the total number of boxes is a 118 that means that time total elements is a what 118 elements now s block is a what their first and the second group now 
P block is a what? 13 to 18. And the F block is a what? That is a down series. That is a what? Two separate series. Down is a given. That is a known as a lactenide and actinide series. This two series is a known as a what? This is a known as a F block element. Now come to the here. Here is a given one zigzag line, right? If you see the in a modern periodic table, just down of a boron. Now see here, 13, that is a boron, aluminium, gallium, right? So you are seeing here what? One zigzag line. That line showing what? The elements of the metalloids. And whatever the line, left hand side, that all elements is known as a metals. So, before the zigzag line, that is the left hand side, that is known as the metals. And the right hand sides of all the elements is known as a what? Non-metals. Now, we are concentrated on the D block element. D block element is also known as a what? Transition element. So, in this modern periodic table, there are the total 118 boxes. It is a divided in the what? Four blocks already I discussed in the that periodic table. That is a S block, P block, D block and F block. S block contains first and two, one to two, P block 13 to 18. D block 3 to 12 and the F block that is a down that two series are given that is a lanthanides and actinides series. Now D block elements are called the transition elements already I discussed there. Now next point is a, a zigzag line shows the metalloids elements. Now left hand sides of the that zigzag line that is a known as a, all the metals. And the right hand sides of all the elements of a line that is a known as a what? Non-metals. Now, so this is a regarding the what? Modern periodic law. And this modern periodic law is a also known as a what? Long form of a periodic law. Thank you very much.